explanations for this phenomenon. The first three stages of pregnancy, ovulation, fertilization, and plantation. Ovulation corresponds to the stage of expulsion of an oocyte through the ovary. Ovulation is the basis of reproduction its purpose is to release an oocyte intro of the fallopian tube. Ovulation usually take place 12 to 16 days before the stare of the next period. How do you know if you are ovulating? Several signs identify the symptoms of ovulation and when it occurs for example. A slight pain in the lower abdomen pinching to the right or left. A feeling of bloating. strong abdominal cramps. A slight tension in the breasts. Transparent strings mucus up but like egg white. An eye crease in libido. A slight rise in temperature in the moraine upon working. A few drops of blood in the pentai's nose as spotting can also be a symptom OS ovulation. The role of ovulation. The purpose of the ovulation is to release an egg or radio and oocyte ready to be fertilized by a sperm in the fallopian tubes and to give birth to an embryo. When a woman ovulate it lasts about four to five days, calculating your ovulation date allows you to know the most fertile period of the menstrual cycle. to calculate the date of ovulation. To calculate your ovulation date already know that the cycle always starts on the first of the last period. If we have a 28 days cycle your ovulation will occur on day 14 of your cycle. If you have a short cycle you can calculate your ovulation day by subtracting 14 from your cycle length for example your cycle is 21 days long 21 minus 14 is equal to 7 your ovulation will be on the 7th day after the first day of your period. If you have a long cycle apply the same calculation for example your cycle is 35 days long 35 minus 14 is equal to 21 your ovulation will be on day 21 of your cycle. If you have an irregular cycle, unfortunately, it will be more difficult for you to estimate your ovulation date. Fertilization Fertilization is the fusion of all maternal egg with paternal sperm. Fertilization occurs during the birth of and sperm. For it to take place, the sperm must pass through the layer that surrounds the egg. 
The egg and sperm fuse into a single cell, sometimes called an egg. The race is long and full of obstacles for the sperm to reach the egg and fertilize it. From several hundred million at ejaculation, only a few thousand will reach the fallopian tubes where the egg is on its way to the uterus. Fertilization takes place in the outer third of the fallopian tube. The woman's fertile period. This period extends approximately from the ninth day after the period until the sixteenth day of the cycle because the spermatozoids can survive approximately five days in the female genital tract while the ovum, more fragile, dies two days after the ovulation. Any unprotected sexual act performed during this interval can therefore lead to a birth. Implantation The fertilized egg begins to develop and slowly descends to the uterus to form an embryo. It will implant in the inner lining of the uterus, called the endometrium. Implantation takes place about seven days after ovulation. This is called implantation point six. The fertilized egg implants there seven days after fertilization. This is nidation. At this point, it clings to a welcoming place and eventually disappears into the depths of the tissues. The egg continues its development by connecting directly with the maternal blood vessels. The first exchanges begin and mark the beginning of pregnancy. 